Alright. Uh, thank God this quest is over. Oh, we're gonna go find Nomad Stanic. <clears throat> Excuse me, Nomad Stanic, the watchmaker. Wow. Wow. Shut up. You disgust me. I hope I never have to come back here. Yeah, I kind of forgot. I've only done that. Oh, John, I know. Oh. I can see your face on the info link. I did the job for Catholic. She told the man herself. It is the first time we have spoken in. Well, uh, things change, huh? The debt you took for a caller is paid. Perhaps it is now I who owes you the favor. I'll remember in no time. <laughs> <laughs> you do that, my friend. Alright. Yeah, I, I've only done that quest for Cadillac like one I've only done that one time ever and it yeah, it's one of the if not the hardest quest in this game, it's definitely up there. Oh, yikes. Oh, I think I'm starting to remember this now. I think I remember what happens in this quest. Yeah! Heavy metal! With the metal hand. You are Rex Power Colt. For. I remember what happens here, but I have to get there first. Of course, getting there is always the hard part. Bomb. Shutters? Maybe not. Wait. Here we go. Yep, alright. Hang on. Wait. What's up? What's up? No, not that. I'm trying to remember what the damn hog. Ah, oh, fuck me. Hang on. All right, there we go. I want to bring up a bio cell because uh, this is gonna get a little hairy. <laughs> He's a level one. Access granted. All right. So we got all these emails here. Looks like her daughter is sick. Yeah, Allison Stanick is very crazy and we're gonna I think run into her later yeah Did I say, keep an eye out, Nomad. 
five, four. Oh, never mind. We don't even get the countdown. Ah! Oh my god, all these freaking crates! Now I wanted to pop the bio cell in case I had a sudden brain cramp and couldn't remember where, where that was. You can just outlast the gas. Yeah. Oh, the, I thought the door locked behind you. You just freaking run out. Huh. Smiley, Static wasn't at his apartment, but I did find what looked like bomb making equipment and a trap set by the Diwali. You're kidding. I also found out where he might be the red light district at a bar across the street from the Red Queen. Oh. Uh, I'm heading there now. We have a couple of agents there in the go. district watching the Diwali now. I'll send them over. Copy that. Back to the red light district. Yeah, I know. The Irish stool. Hey, I'm a citizen. I have rights. You cannot detain me without charging me. This. I know! And I know you're gonna sit there quietly and wait with us like a good little watchmaker. <laughs> I've got this, Agent Riley. You and your partner can relax for a few minutes. Wait, I know you. You've been in my shop. What is this? You have some things to answer for, Mr. Static. We have evidence linking you and your shop to the train station bombing. Bombing? No! I would never... I, I wouldn't even know where to start. You have the I like how his hair is totally glitching out. Do I? <laughs> Convince me. I have a timing device with your name on it, and I found the tools to make even more bombs in your apartment. What else am I supposed to think? But you've been to my shop. You know I fix watches. I don't make bombs. No. Those tools aren't mine. They belong to my... Your daughter? No. No. Yes. Look, <laughs> take me in. I'm the one you're looking for, not her. I, I have made bombs for them. I don't think so. Protecting your daughter. <laughs> we knew the whole static. time. Don't worry. But you're not doing her any good by taking the blame. You need to tell me what you know. I. You are right. I know. Allison was in the military. She always wanted to belong, to be part of something greater than herself. She was such a beautiful child. Gifted. What happened? After the incident, she met some people. They said they were her friends, but I could see they only wanted to use her. Parasites! And, and now? Now? I like how we're just saying all this right with these help. random guys She's right behind them. She's <laughs> been coerced! Calm down. What do you mean they've taken her? Allison and I were supposed to meet here tonight. Instead, one of them came by spewing curses about fleshers and naturals. He gave me a message from her. She was... She was saying goodbye. But she would never... They used her. And now they intend to make her disappear. Hmm. Does your daughter have the expertise to do this? Much more than I do. She was in the military. EOD, they called it. Explosive Ordnance Disposal. The bomb squad? Yes. She was happy in the military. They augmented her, rebuilt her to make her better at what she did. But after the incident, she was dishonorably discharged. She was lost. And that's when these new friends found her. Obviously, they're Ark, by the way. 
Ark and the Church of the Machine people we that we saw, I think it was one of the early, it was definitely one of the earlier episodes, I can't remember which one explicitly was. What do you know about these friends of hers? Other than they were augmented? Not much. They only spoke to Allison when they came to the shop. As if anyone unaugmented was beneath them. They kept talking about the Ascension, whatever that is. Your apartment was booby-trapped by Radich Nikoladze. What? Why would he...? I guess friendship means nothing to a duck. <laughs> what happened? I was never a wealthy man, but my shop is well-known and respected. British liked my watches. He knew I needed money after what happened to Allison. So we strike a deal. Deals are like beautiful women to that man. A better one always comes around. <laughs> Where can I find Allison, Mr. Stanek? I wish I knew. I would go and get her away from those people. I was about to go looking for her when your goon showed up. We'll find her. I need you to go with these agents. I'll have some more questions for you. No! I have to go! I have to help her! She's... She's all I have! Please, let us do our job. Find my daughter, or I will! <laughs> oh, we will find him. Oh, we will. Smiley, I spoke to Stanek. He's not our guy, but he has a daughter. Yeah, her his daughter. If you saw that quick picture on the she might be the computer, is heavily, heavily inspired by a the one uh, replicant girl from Blade Runner. I'll make sure they lean on. Good. Let me know what happens. All right. So our next main quest is go to go use the NSN device back in TF29, and we're gonna have a very trippy time with that. One of the, uh, let's just say, weirder parts of this game. Great. They were nice to find another bottle. Something to keep us warm. Who would even listen to that crap? Prague looks a lot better in uh, the nighttime here. The daytime parts of it just kind of looks plain and bland. It's a lot cooler at night. Looks a lot more Deus Sexy. One could say Deus Sexy. I should have stayed in bed. Oh, I can't jump on the elevator. This part's gonna be weird. There's no other way to say it. To be in Gollum City. It also takes a decent bit of time to get through. Oh, wrong spot. Let's do this. Alex, I'm in. Anything I need to know before I start up this chair? Every NSN is different, man, so I'm not sure what to expect. I'm guessing you'll end up in some kind of virtual conference room. No one else should be in there. And if they are? They'll see you as Miller. They'll say something snippy and log off. <laughs> okay. Where do I find these stored conversations? How if I know? This is your <laughs> plan. But holographic recordings take up a lot of virtual memory, so you may have to look in several. 
several places. I'll just have to play it by ear. All these so exactly. toes are super off. The whisper chip is still in place, though, so we'll both know when he's done it. Good luck, Adam. Get ready for this. <laughs> 